Okay, here's everything else I got today. Um, an assortment of stuff. I'm just going to go through it. That's, I'll start with this. Kind of a nice painting. I got that today. Um, and you can see pretty good detail in the ducks and the birds in flight. Um, artist was not too bad, but he didn't really want the world to know who he was because he just initialed at JR. So, anyway, I only paid $8. I think I'll get about, I don't know, 30 20 to 30 at least. Okay. Let me just go through the games. Got a N64 with nothing. Uh, just the power supply. Page 5, I will complete it. And uh, then I'll sell it for 25 with the game. Um, these are the games I got today. Got a, a mix, not too many old school. Spec Ops, PS1, Tiny Tank, PS1. I need to check out these. I got a few Xbox games, Street Racing. I won't pay more than a dollar for these. Smashing Drive. Then I bought an assortment of Wii and Xbox uh, and such games, and I mostly paid less than five dollars for. I don't really know exactly what between three and five on average, um, and I was sell these in the eight to ten dollar range. Most of them, some some will get a little bit more. Uh, Army Men, Soldiers of Misfortune, Star Wars, The Clone Wars, uh, Three Men, Raving Rabbits 2, Need for Speed Undercover, Assassin's Creed, Bottom Hits Brink, uh, Army of Two, Resident Evil. Batman Arkham City, that might be a little bit more than $10. But look at that. I hate the swing. Okay. Alright, uh, G.I. Joe, The Rise of Cobra, over there. Uh, Midnight Club Los Angeles, Red Dead Redemption, Need for Speed, Hot Pursuit, we go uh, Assassin's Creed 3, Halo 3, uh, Gears of War 3, Modern Warfare 2, Ultimate Alliance 2, Halo Reach. This wind is ridiculous. Uh, Medal of Honor Limited Edition. Crisis 3. Crisis 2. Soul Calibur 2. And here's the only game that I actually paid $12 for. Super Mario Galaxy. I'll sell it for 20 or so. Um, not to be greedy. I just, you know, it should be a relatively easy sell. And I will sell it for that. And this should keep the wind from blowing my games away. And let me get on the side so I don't have my shadow in. Okay, bought a box full of Thomas the Tank stuff for $5. Um, you can sell this stuff at flea markets, two, three dollars a piece, sometimes somewhere in that range. Uh, so this, to me, is probably, for my $5, I'll get about $20. I paid a buck a piece for these two separately, and I will probably sell them $3 or so. You know, nothing exciting, but people like them, they sell. Bought these little figures, kind of neat, made in Uruguay. Um, but I paid like 25 cents for the three. If I sell them a buck a piece, I'm like killing on profit on those. Got some DVDs. I'll just go through uh, them quickly to show to my friend. Silence of the Lamb, Grand Torino, Paris of the Caribbean, uh, Yabba Gabba Gabba, uh, New Friends, Holiday Celebration, Mickey and Pals, almost were. He won't want these really. Almost music. Okay, these are kids. Let me just see. I'll just show them. I'll read them. He might want the, the Mickey Clubhouse, but I doubt it. Got a Puss in Boots, um, Despicable Me, then I got a few Thomas and Friends, uh, stuff like people, okay, kids videos, kids DVDs are an easy sell at the flea markets, bought a little bit of clothes, um, you can get, if you can get jean jackets for a dollar at a yard sale, you can sell them for five to eight dollars at the flea market. same with jeans and other clothes, um, bought a DVD player, five bucks, and at the flea markets I go to, I'll get at least ten bucks. Box full of CDs, paid 25. There's uh, supposedly 65 there. Nothing too exciting, you know. But whatever. It's I'll make money in the long run off of those. Uh, in terms of, well, this is the rest of it. Uh, I guess I guess I'm going pretty good. This is neat, isn't it? This is a purse, and I guess I think this is made out of bamboo. But look at the way it's constructed. Very neat. Um, I only paid a dollar, so that should be at least ten dollars. Uh, got a couple pieces of pink milk glass. This is, was made in Cleveland. Napco, okay. Two pieces of Napco. Uh, you can't really tell, but they have a very light pink tint. I don't believe they're worth a fortune. But fortunately for me, I only paid a buck a piece for them. Uh, nice enamel picture. As you can see, I paid $2. I will sell this for $10 at the flea market so I go to. Then I got these two bowls. I believe these are haul or hull or, or something like that. As you can see, I paid 75 cents a piece, and I will probably sell the two uh, 
maybe, I don't know, four, maybe ten to twelve dollars for a two. And, uh, yeah, that covers everything I got today.